what is up guys it's your boy scooter back again with another video and today i will be unboxing the ultra slim bluetooth keyboard by anchor so i decided to get a new keyboard because i really got tired of of the the wired one that i had um i've been using this one it's supposed to glow it's supposed to glow the the lights are supposed to glow uh blue but uh, when I bought this, I didn't realize it's not compatible with the Mac, so the LEDs do not work, which kind of sucks. I should have sent it back, but I didn't. But anyway, here it is. This is by Anchor, and like I said, I decided to buy this because I needed a new keyboard. And plus, this keyboard is wireless, and it has Bluetooth capabilities. And I can, so if whenever I'm um, using it, when I'm done using it, I can just put it away instead of having to leave it on top because it's not because it's not wired. So I'll go ahead and open it up or show you around the box what they pretty much make. Uh, they make batteries, uh, which I'm sure is just external batteries, keyboards, mice, hubs, USB hubs and readers and cases and screen protectors and like I said this is by uh, anchor and I think this was priced at I think it was like $30 I believe it was either $30 or $25 and I just really needed a new keyboard because I got tired of using this one and another thing I decided to get this because I don't have to sit at my desk whenever I use it. Wow, this thing is extremely smaller than I thought. But really, they said that this keyboard is supposed to be for your iPad or whatever, or any smaller device or like, I can actually use this on my phone, but I can't show you guys because I'm actually using my cell phone to record this video. Um, but, this is a really small keyboard. I didn't know, I didn't think it was that small, but, or at least the keys are really small. But comes in the box is basically your um, USB cable, which is to charge the keyboard, which I believe it has a 340 milliamp uh, battery inside of here. I don't even think they show the milliamps on here, but I've, I think I read it on the description that it had a 340 milliamp uh, battery inside of here, which kind of makes sense because it's not a whole lot of space in here to put a battery. But let's go ahead and look at the device. If I can get it open. Oh, here we go. Now, oh, here's the instructions back here. Gonna say they sent this and didn't send any instructions but first off um, these are really like soft keys you can't really hear it that much get the video to focus there it is um, it's really soft keys and on the back it has an uh, aluminum back you know, it has that cold feel of aluminum. And really think this is a really cool keyboard. But let's look at the instructions, or should we? And they have, they send you a, a happy and a not happy, which I'm guessing is just wanting you to rate the device. Go online and give them a rank or no it's just for customer service yeah just for customer service and then they have the instruction manual basically just telling you what all it supports but on here it says that oh it was 280 milliamp hour battery which will last for 30 days standby time so that means you're not using it and if you leave the battery on and you're using it it'll last for 140 hours 
Wow. It says that this keyboard has a life of 5 million clicks. So I'm guessing if you type a lot on here, it won't last very long. But anyway, that's pretty much it as far as it goes. You, It works basically like any other keyboard. You just um, connect it. Um, let me see if it says how many devices I can charge or connect this to at one time. I believe it's just three. Eh, whatever. I'm going to waste your time. But anyway, that is pretty much it for the keyboard. You turn it on. And then you see that it just turned on. And it's, I believe it's in pairing mode. And then, yeah, it's in pairing mode. So I need to uh, wait. Or you need to click this button to put it in a uh, pairing mode. And basically, you just pair it just like any other device or any other Bluetooth device. Even as on here, iOS, Android, and Windows, if you have either one of those. And that is pretty much it as far as this video goes. And if you like this video, be sure to like and subscribe. And comment down below on your thoughts of this keyboard. And I will catch you guys in the next one.